What's up, everybody? It's Nerp here, and today we're gonna play a ranked match. Master Freak 11. Good luck. Have fun. So the deck I'm using today is a. It's, I almost said mono energy structures. It is a structure energy deck, but it has an order splash. And I like my starting hand because it has a two-drop structure law memorial, which will get me some order. So um. I saw some people in the past play this kind of deck. I think it was Eva who used to play it a while ago. It's like a deck that rolls around structure energy, but it does it does a lot of damage with um, with Iron Ogres and Tempo Thefts and Speeds. And so far, it's been doing well in ranked. Um, Proximity Star is pretty good, especially with Machine Chant, but he's energy. So. I mean, he's a lot of ranged creatures if he's struck if he's a uh, ranged energy. It'd be pretty weird if he's structure energy in this matchup. I'll have to find out. But lately in ranked, I've been going with yes, he doesn't have a two drop. That's nice. And all second villains also because I do have machine chant. I'm gonna have some structures, and it looks pretty good. I'm gonna have a forge out, and this thing will probably break, and I'll get some order, and then I can sack for wild. So lately in. Lately in ranked, I've been using Mono Decay and this deck, Energy Order Structures. And right now it's kind of like Rock, Paper, Scissors for me because if I play this deck, oh, this is weird. I think he might be Structure uh, Energy. If that's the case, I'm not sure who is the edge the Mono Deck or the. Um, or the Order Splash. I'd probably give it to the Splash, but I'm not sure. So I'll definitely be able to do like Iron Ogres and like I'll be able to tempo fed my clock libraries and speed them and stuff like that. But yeah, it is like rock or scissors for me right now because it's it feels like I just uh, if I play structure engine it's a, like a decay deck I'm playing, like, I get the auto win. If it's if it's something else, it's like then it's up in the air. And a lot of people are decay, so like that's pretty good odds. Right now, because Decay Ramp decks are really good, and this beats Decay Ramp decks. And, um, I could Bishy Chat with all these huge damage, I'll just take the burn while I can. Got some lag there. Ah, uh, Drew Machine Dominator. Um, do I, what do I, do I sacrifice it? I think I am going to sacrifice the Dominator for cards. Against Energy, I feel like it would be pretty easy for him to destroy. But it could give me the edge in a structure battle. Maybe I shouldn't have done that, but I do love Machine Chance uh, Ramp. Okay, so he puts another one of those out. Not too bad. And now I think I'm going to sacrifice. I do have a Speed Ogre combo, but it's gonna take a while to get enough energy for that. So I'm gonna sack the Speed for cards. Yeah. Cause I don't want to be locked into something after playing good. That, I think that was good. Because now, I play that. And now, next turn, I will hopefully, if he doesn't kill any of my structures this turn, I'll machine chant the charge coil. It looks like I'm going to have to take a big ether pump hit, which is pretty annoying. Especially against energy with um, sudden eruptions and ether pumps and a lot of rules so you can get that my stuff fast. And now I am not going to be able to. Hmm. Okay. Well, I do have this going off, so I can uh, do a little bit of a machine chant. I'll keep my sudden eruption. I'm going to sack proximity charge. And I'll just go for a machine chant. So now the ether pump will finish this off, and I'll just take a center of the board place with my gun auto. Okay, pretty good. And now, this is going to go into 2 health, and that's going to go into 2 health, that's not too good. But we are doing a little better on cards and resources right now. Okay. Oh yeah, by the way, uh... Oh, that's a VD. It's kind of like second VD already. So now both of these guys die to a, die to um, a sun eruption or thunder or stuff like that. I'm gonna sack the sun eruption so I can get the forge and divinator out. Okay. I'll 
go for the forge right in the middle. Go for the dimner down there. It's nice to get some damage on the idols too. That can mean a lot in an energy structure energy versus structure energy match because the Psalm Giants can take down those eight health idols. But uh, what was I saying? I am not going to have uh, that many videos up in the next week and a half or two weeks ish. One to two weeks. Or maybe one to three weeks, I'm not sure. Because, um, as you probably know, the summer is coming up and that means the school year is ending and that also means my final exams. And it was a great year of playing scrolls. But that means that I uh, have to cram for a lot of tests now. <laughs> So, yeah, this might be my last video for like a couple weeks. But I'll be back into the thick of things and playing a lot of scrolls and Minecraft over the summer. So you can expect a lot of content from me this summer. And now, that was odd, he plays a lot of memorials. So, like, it's interesting. Um, now, what do I want to do? What's more important for me to take the lawnmower or the ether pump? Probably the, the ether pump. Lawnmower is going to get him some stuff. I'm going to keep the ogre. I'm going to... Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I have 6 right now. You know what? I'm going to uh, sack for energy and play both of these things. Yeah, okay. That's the plan. So now we're in a little bit of a weird spot with Machine Champ. Because, like, we're, I really want to keep Machine Champ, but now we only have one card, so... It might be hard to decide what to, like, sack. But I like getting a massive war control now. So we are threatening both of his things. As it stands, we would have to choose what to destroy. And now, okay, burns that, so another long memorial. Okay. Oh, I'll have to sack the card, I can't play them both. Yeah, I only have seven energy. So wild makes it seven. Uh. Hmm. Okay. I think I'll sacrifice this. Ooh, long memorial. But I do want to get rid of this. Too bad I can't play anything, but I am getting a, like a, a gun automaton. So that's nice. It'd be nice for this charge girl to hit the ether pump. Or I guess out of them works because I can, now I can machine chant that. If I'm, I'm, I'm stopping him from getting order, which is really nice. I think we're playing very similar decks. And he, so he's going to get order like by himself, which slows him down ramping wise. Oculus Cannon. I see a lot of people play that. Ooh, Power Bound. And a Divinator. That was a nice play by him. Now he and he got that ether pump off. Uh, ooh, I like that ogre I have in my hand right now. Um, I'll sack the clock library, I think. Okay, yeah, because now I can go long more the machine chant and deal three damage to something, but that won't really do anything. Hmm, he's gonna get three order from that. Hmm. I don't really want that to happen. <laughs> uh. I can't go with the luck chance that this is gonna like do something. That'd be too risky. Okay, so I'll go with a long moral of my own. And now I'm going to go with 
a machine chant so that at least deals three and then even if he plays another um okay that was kind of annoying if it something else that would be better he's that thing's breaking now anyways so now he can play speed ogres so i have to watch out and i machine chant that so now i could burn that this turn hmm Wait, will the machine divinator make these attack? I actually don't know. Okay, well, now I have enough for to do my own um, speed ogres, or tempo theft orders, ogres. And now, let's see, I have a burn. Hmm, probably should have moved him up so I have more, more power in the middle of the board. But I'll sack the middle wonder now. can't move up because then this is definitely going to attack. Ooh, sudden eruption, that's nice. Yeah, so it's, it's three things. Okay, I'm going sudden eruption. I gotta hope that. W Actually, it's not a big. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm going for it. Hmm. Interesting. I actually don't know. That was good. So is it, are these going to attack? Yeah, I think it's going to attack. I thought the Diviner didn't make it attack. Uh, that was a 1-4 chance that it didn't hit this guy, so that was a little unlucky for me. Oh, we can get a Thunder Surge off. Eh. These Oculus Sense are actually really underrated. They're really hard to work around. Even I'm Structure Energy with not many moving creatures. Are you gonna do like bombard? Okay. So I have to get rid of those things. Ah, uh, it's annoying. Um. Want to get rid of those Oculus cannons? I can't really move up here. Uh. I gotta get rid of this guy, so I'll start with a spark and decide what I do after now. Yeah. I'll spark you. And then I will VD that. Um, I'm gonna sack the Divinator. Ooh, Tempo Theft. Ah. I should have sacrificed. That was a mistake. I haven't played in a while. I'm making some mistakes here. I should have sacrificed for um, scrolls first. I'm going to burn. And then I'm going to spark. And now I'll move you back. Okay. Good. Okay, so we cleared those things off the board. His, his deck is halfway cycled, so we so we don't have to worry about those for a while. I can actually win soon with ogres and stuff. So now I can go with a tempo theft ogre using one of my gun autos or my divinator. I, I have four things to attack. So uh, he BDs that, fine. If that's his whole turn, I'll take that. And now... I can. Yeah, I'm gonna let this thing, these guys live this turn. I don't think it's a huge threat right now. I could go to the Tempest of Ogre and destroy stuff. But I'm gonna let it stay. Instead, I think I'm gonna go with a. Uh. You know what? Yeah, actually, I am going to, um. I'm going to sacrifice the clock library for cards. Yeah, okay, I got another card. And I'm going to VD this. And I'll destroy this while I can. But now I am in a 
place where he can get a nice thunder surge off. But I haven't seen it yet, so hopefully he doesn't have it. I'm not running thunder surge in my deck, I don't think. So maybe he is not running it in his. Oh, uh, speed ogre would also be really nice for him here. Tempo theft ogre would not work. Sacking resources, so, okay, metal wonder, fine. Not worried about that. Okay, he's just getting structures on the board. Ooh, waking stones. Maybe I should have saved that balance of wrestle for that. A uh, speed ogre. I have a lot of things right now that I could do. Hmm. I'm going to sacrifice the spark for cards. Um. He has no cars right now. This could be a chance for me to. I can do that soon. I'm going to go for a clock library tempo theft right now. And just get more cards. And then I'll play a forge. And I could actually win this game quite quickly. That was a, that was a nice. So, so that Tempo Theft Clock Library builds up my hand. But now this Divinator is not really doing much for now. And I think I'm going to start trying to hit things with Solemn Giant. This row looks pretty locked up. I mean, this Metal Wonder could be a problem in, like, in a while. But these other two structures, it's kind of RNG. I gotta just hope that doesn't like screw me over. And I don't know about that, it's going to be a big deal. Okay, he does get the machine champ, but he wasn't even that useful right now anyways. And this is kind of good. Um, I'm not going to bother hitting that Waking Stones. I'd rather hit this other stuff. Ooh, actually, I found Dispersal. Um, I'm going to keep the Balance Dispersal. We have enough order, so I'm going to sack Belmar for uh, resources. Then we have nine of that stuff. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and play a... I have seven cards left. Um, yeah, we're going to recycle our deck, so I am going to start doing some fun stuff with like the ogre, I think. So I'll just do a bunch of idle damage right now. I'll go ahead... and deal some damage. Right here. Okay. And now that he, if he Valance Dispersals it, I'll be kind of bummed out because I have more speeds and tempo thefts in my hand. But, I mean, that's kind of okay for us because we're gonna, our deck is recycling. And I don't even think we've drawn all three ogres. I think it's a very close match. Interesting decks. Waking stones. Okay, we're going to have to do use of ounce dispersal. Okay, I have to hope nothing hits. Uh, whatever, it's not a huge deal, that little guy. And... We can't actually do a whole ton here. I think I'm going to have to balance dispersal. Yeah, I'm going to balance dispersal. Uh, I'm going to balance dispersal. this dude or that dude, I don't know let's get rid of that dude actually and now I think I'm going to go for the speed machinated 
yeah. Speed, machinated, and deal with, uh, and I'll get rid of that. Okay. Very nice. And if he doesn't get rid of that this turn, I can tempo theft to make it attack again. So it's basically forcing him to get rid of that now. If he has anything he could use, and he can't. So, is that GG? Oh no, there's that was, that was a mash needed. Um, not sure. Wait, let's just do this. So twelve. All right, so that's the uh, idol. And now, um, some giant can't go this turn. Ooh. But if I go with a mash needed, seven, ah, uh, it's not enough. Darn it. Actually, let's go with the mash needed. Because, go like that. And now, He can't play a spell, or he has a one-third chance of losing. Yay. So he's going to have to bounce dispersal that thing now. And he doesn't have many cards right now. I'm looking good. Unless he gets like a surprise, like a... Uh, electrify, uh... Corrode win. And he just went for the one-third chance of losing, and he lucked out. Uh, that was actually the one I really didn't want to hit because I could probably use the sound giant to pick up something else. Okay. Um, burn. <laughs> Select the charge for cards. I'll go for the. What does this thing do anyways now? When it doesn't remember to destroy increased energy one. Oh, that's actually kind of annoying. Hmm. I'll. Go oh, shoot. No, connect. Oh, there we go. That was interesting. I never happened to before. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to fill up my board a bit here. I'm going to move you down. I'm going to put a divinator back here. And I, I don't want to burn. He's just gonna get energy. But I'll do it. I gotta, I gotta move things out of the way. And if he has thunderstorm, it should be time to use it. <laughs> A weird spot here. <laughs> like I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to mash into him. Oh. Uh. I can, I could do this, right? I can sell him giant up there to just do eight damage and then I have a two third chance of winning when uh, when the wonder goes. I think that's our best plan. Yeah. Spread out a bit. Oh well, we're gonna lose a uh, Glen Auto here. I wanna stop playing so many spells. I don't wanna screw myself over. Okay, so now, unless he has like Faith Blessings, he really can't play another spell. <laughs> Go ahead, play a spell, Master Freak. I still have this thing. Waking stones up there, got it. I saw him giant. And he's gonna pump it up and take out that idol. 
So now we're both kind of in a spot where we don't really want to play any spells. Actually, never mind. Oh, that was nice. Uh, Lucky didn't hit anything, but I thought he was killing Idol for a second. I was a little confused. Okay. Um, can we win? Speed on you. That would be 12. So 12 plus, that's 14, and we can spark something. So that's 14, this is 10. Oh, it's, uh, actually, I think we win right now without even doing anything. So, GG. Yeah. And let's just sudden eruption just to make sure we uh, get it done. Yeah, I think we win. All right. So, that's getting some rating back. We lost a lot of rating recently because I just, I've been losing and I haven't really playing much, so I got some rating decay without making it up. So, uh, I think this will be the last video for like a week or two. So, thank you all for watching. Subscribe if you uh, like my videos. Like the video if you really like this video. And keep on scrolling, everybody. I will make a lot of videos over the summer, so stay tuned for that. And keep on scrolling, everybody. See ya.